the same code running. The code just knows how to smartly scale up to run on the tablet. So it's basically the same OS on a different resolution, the different device. Exactly. It just happens to know. One thing that we did here is that we here we show the multi-user login screen. So you can actually uh, uh, set up your tablet or your phone for multiple users. I think it's more common for a tablet. They'd have one at home. And, yeah, definitely. You know. So I'm going to use a guest account to start um, demoing this. And uh, oh, it looks like someone's having some fun. Someone opened the terminal. So um, it's, you see, it works exactly the same. Um, looks like there's a lot of apps open. So here's a gallery app. Yeah, someone took a picture of the desk. So here's a gallery app. It's the same gallery app that is on the phone. It's exactly the same. One thing that we have that's different here is that since there's a wider surface area, you can see I can run a small thing on the side. So this is called the side stage. I don't know what happened there. This is called the side stage. And I can run different apps on the side stage. So I can multitask on the tablet by running one app on the main stage and one app on the side stage. Of course, on the phone, you can't do that because there's simply not enough space. Uh, I saw a terminal. Uh, yep. ju just Yeah, there it is. So uh, does it use uh, apt-get uh, commands for uh, repository, uh, or it's uh, only uh, app store access um, to, to apps? The answer is, it depends on what you want. So by default, what we do is we have the system I'm sorry if I get, I don't want to get too too crazy for who you're using. Yeah, but uh, by default, we have the system is read only. So you can't use app get by default. And the reason we do that is because we want you to update the system. We want it to be very, very robust. And as you know, apps can sometimes have problems yeah. trying to figure out what the dependencies are. It can bail out. We never want that to happen to you on your phone. So instead, what we do is we make the core system read only. And then when we have an update on the server, we take a binary diff. This is the version you have, this is the new version. We only send the binary diff down, and then we apply the binary diff, and then restart. And that way it's very, very robust. It's very, very hard to fail. We have a lot of fail safes built in. Um, that said, when we build the system, we use AppGet. It's still Debian-based, Ubuntu, everything. So like our developers use AppGet. Furthermore, if you, it's still your device. So if you want to, you own it, you can just say, hey, you know what, I actually do want to use AppGet. What we do is we just drop a little file that you can touch on there and say, make it read only. You have to have permissions to do that. So it's like, it's, or no one can root your phone, but you can choose to, basically. But we make it, we document how to do it, so you don't have to do some crazy. Then you can go ahead and use AppGet. Uh, if you do use AppGet, though, then we can't apply the binary get diff, so then you have to you're responsible you're yeah. for updating after that. Yeah. Well, not you know we still make still try to make it work as well as we can. Just so the, don't close it. <laughs> right. Yeah. Yeah. So the way we can do that with applications is we have a new packaging format called Click, and Click is a very simple format, and it only applies it on a partition that is read write. It's called the user partition. So that has we have a core a core SD that it, you can depend on. Anything else that you want, instead of having a dependency like in Debian, you have to bundle it, statically link it, and then it'll come down in the click package and get installed with it. And so that way you get apps from the app store in that way. Um, you can use the terminal, you know, I don't know if OEMs are going to ship with the terminal, but I suppose you could just install one. But we don't think it's really for consumers or end users. Yeah. I, I just saw it, so 